There is a path through a marsh that I must take to go home. Mallows and thick black loam, alder and bog grass harsh, and the marsh pools glinting with lights of the sunset that stains the sky. That is all to the eye, yet something is there that affrights. Something which I never see, though I feel its eyes on my back as I cross on that narrow track. Something that watches me. It is never Bittern who thumps at his hidden churn in the reeds. It is never Heron who feeds in the shallows beside old stumps. Or a spotted frog who eyes me passing his tiny lake where the great green bubbles break and the veils of the bog mists rise. But deeper than long drowned log, something that never sleeps lies crouched in those oozy deeps, something as old as the bog. They say that there was a time when natives called the sod the place of the evil god and prayed to the quivering slime. They say that a face would appear in the mists that the night winds brew and would ask for its ancient due, one human heart a year. All that is a long closed book, but still as I pass on that track I feel something's eyes on my back, and I never dare turn to look, for fear that the mist should spread and curdle to mouth and eyes, malefic and old and wise, demanding its terrible bread.